Cancer is among the leading causes of death worldwide. Lung cancer ranks top three cancers in both genders, accounting for 13% of all cancer incidents. Why is lung cancer so common? Research has found several risk factors that may increase chances of getting lung cancer. Studies indicate risk factors could damage lung cells. Carcinogens induce inflammation, resulting in pathogenic proliferation, oxidative damage, and gene promoter methylation, which contribute to cancer development. Lung cancer is morphologically classified into four main subtypes. These four types can be grouped into small cell lung cancer, SCLC, and non-small cell lung cancer, NSCLC. Tumor classification is key to treatment options and prognosis of lung cancer. During the cancer progression, specific biomarkers may be seen in different subtypes. The biomarkers of NSE and pro-GRP usually present in small cell lung cancer, while the levels of CEA, Cypher 21-1, and SCCA are often elevated in non-small cell lung cancer. High levels of these tumor markers can be a sign of lung cancer. Along with other tests, tumor marker tests can help subtype diagnosis and treatment management. In particular, during diagnosis and prognosis, if the NSE and pro-GRP levels are elevated, it could indicate the occurrence and negative outcomes of small cell lung cancer. If the levels of the other three biomarkers go up, it could signify the similar of non-small cell lung cancer. Lung cancer biomarkers can also be used in patient surveillance. They may offer valuable indications for post-operative follow-up care, control of therapy efficacy, detection of recurrent disease. MindRay provides a complete lung cancer tumor marker panel. These biomarkers could play an important role in aiding diagnosis, predicting prognosis, and monitoring treatment of lung cancers.